Hello, we're, we're at the Sahali Falls Cemetery and we're looking at the Bowden plot. The Bowden family is a very interesting family. I discovered that the Bowden family was initially buried in the Sahali Center Cemetery, the one that happened to have been moved in 1904. And I've discovered through looking at the list of that 1904 cemetery, looking at the list of the the stones that were moved into the back of the evergreen and into the main body of evergreen. And I compared all those lists and by subtraction I figured out that the Bowden family was the only family that had their stone in that big a move in 1904 not go to the, the Evergreen Cemetery. They are put into the Sahali Falls Cemetery. The only one. And I proved it mathematically by all these subtraction of names. Incredible. So about eight of the Bowden family came here and they rejoined the other part of the Bowden family that was being buried in the falls. So, such as uh, the Bowden children and grandchildren were all buried around here. Now some of these are great, but the good thing about this, I gave an hour-long presentation on the Bowden family, uh, the South Hadley Public Library this year, and that video is available on the internet. It's linked into my site, so you don't have to do much. I don't talk much because everything that I can say is already in an hour-long video. That obviously you see inside it has seven names, and those are, are the ones that were buried in the Sahali Center, Center Cemetery. The ones towards the front you can't see today, but those are the ones that came later. And it was Henry Bowden who was one of the last children of the Bowden family, and his wife and his, I think, five of his eight children are buried in the cemetery. And he might have had, he might have been the one in 1904 to give permission for them to move the stone down here. They would have to pay with their own money for the move of the bodies and of the stone. Whereas all the other people in the center cemetery that are moved didn't have to pay. They were paid by South Hadley to have their bodies and stone moved to the back of Evergreen. So this is a great discovery. So watch the video. Thanks for coming.